Okay, we're here with King Philip, winner of our distance medley relay, 1045 unofficially. Guys, who do we have here? Mike Griffin, Joe Von Joseph, Eric Lorenzo, Michael Norberg. So, Mike, you let off uh, this relay team 308. We got you unofficially, so you were flying. Uh, tell me about that leg. Was that the intention to run that quick? Did you think you could run that quick? Well, honestly, I was looking for faster. I wanted 305 or less just to get these guys the ball, get the ball rolling for these guys. But then again, it is my first it is my first race back since uh, for Walker National. So I'm still a little bit rusty. I'm sure I'll get a little faster down the line, but I would I would love to be a little faster today. And who is our second leg? I love. And what did you run for a split? Uh, I'm not positive. I don't remember. I think you were like 54-ish. Yeah. Oh, 54. Yeah, so tell me about getting the baton with a, a huge lead that Mike gave you. Uh, I was just, just trying to go with my narrow strategy. Take it out really fast, slow down a little bit, save energy, then just go off the next lap. If yeah. I ran a 54, then I guess it's not a great race, but it's just nice to try. Well, what's your PR? 50.86. Did you find it difficult, like, running by yourself pretty much? Because yeah, that's pretty of. much what it was. Uh-huh. It was very confusing from all that. And then our 800 leg yeah. over here. So what'd you run for your uh, first split? 207. 207. Is uh, that about what you were figuring? It's it's an indoor PR for me. I would have liked to run like 204 or sub, but uh, I, I took it today. Um, felt, felt a little off, but you know, it is what it is. Went out there. And then we have our mile leg, and you have to finish this thing off. So yeah, talk about your leg uh, getting that baton with with a good lead, and then having a, to bring it home. Um, yeah. These boys over here gave me a nice lead. Um, I had to really bring in if I wanted us to qualify for nationals, which was the goal today. Um, realized it was kind of a long shot, like halfway through the race. Felt like, all right, just secure this win. Just hopefully the time plays a factor. And it's like these guys, I can't really talk right now. But <laughs> what I'm trying to say is these guys gave me a good enough lead to uh, cap the thing off with the first place finish. So grateful for them. Yeah, uh, so are you guys going to be running this really again at another meet, maybe a, new, a meet in New York or, or even a, I don't think any so. other meet? So the only time that we'd be running again would be D2 relays, but me and Norbert are going to be in New York for a mile steeplechase. For a mile steeplechase? Yeah, and Mike, let's talk about you. So you're coming off that great cross-country season, win the Division One title, then qualify for Foot Locker. What's your goals this year? I mean, 414's your PR, right, for yep. the mile. So my guess, under 410. Uh, yeah, I definitely want to go under 410, indoor and outdoor, a little bit faster outdoor. Um, I, I'd like to get a really good two mile in. I've been kind of floating like the 930, 940 range when I know I should be around 910. So, so hopefully I can get a good two mile in and then just throw in maybe a thousand, sub 228. Those are like the bigger goals, I guess, but obviously team goals. I'd like to have a couple good relays come down me to New York for that. Just. Yeah, that was going to be my next question. So how about the team? How's the team? been doing so far this year are you guys satisfied with how the team's been doing um i think i think we're satisfied personally but we're all like looking bigger and just trying to take more that we have so if we end up getting that would be great but happy where we are right now we're just always looking for more well guys congratulations on the win today and good luck uh the remainder of the season but great job thank, thank you, you. Thank you.